Good morning, YouTube folks. It's Brad. I'm coming to you from the car. So we're going to do a little bit of an update on this Rage. I've been playing like a beast with this Rage. And I'll tell you what, it has been a phenomenal performer for me. Um, the fact that I can have my RDA in the car and it act like a tank is awesome. Um, overall, this has performed 100%. And I tell you what, this dead rabbit, man, it's phenomenal. It is just a hell of a beast. It is just kicking ass, and it is just taking names. Give me a second here. I just got to get some things organized before I head out. Uh, it's been a beast. Um, I haven't really pushed my dead rabbit above 100 watts. Um, the coils that I have in there are 0.1, running at about 0.1 ohm, and if I bring it over 115 watts, it just gets too freaking hot and burny uh, for me. 100 watts has been very comfortable, 75 watts, nice and cool, still a lot of flavor, um, but with regard to performance, uh, it's, been, it's been a damn near perfect performer, uh, so I really can't complain. Battery drain, though, I get more battery out of my drag, more battery life out of my drag with the same batteries. I don't know if that's, I don't know what that is, um, and that's with the same setup. So taking my dead rabbit as it's set up, putting it on the drag and doing a full day of chain vaping, um, <clears throat> I'm getting about this, I'm getting better battery performance out of the drag. I don't know if that has to do with the chip or not. But I'll tell you what, um, overall the performance has been great and um, absolutely no complaints. Uh, the thing is a beast, I'll tell you right now, it is a heavy trucker. Um, it's a solid friggin' brick in the hand, no complaints. Uh, love the fact that it's got some heft to it. You know, you, some of these mods that they're coming out with are ultra light. They feel plasticky. Um, the Rage has been nothing but a powerhouse brick. Same with the Drag. The same with my X Fang. Uh, just a freaking brick. It is awesome. I am totally happy with it. 100% happy. And I can't complain. Absolutely cannot complain. Still playing around with the Plan B Supply Company, the deck. Uh, love it a lot more as a dripper. I'll tell you right now, as a dripper, it is a much, much better performer than a squonk for me. Um, that's just it. Uh, but, with that being said, it's still a solid performer, but I definitely like my Dead Rabbit over the deck uh, for squonking. For dripping, they're both phenomenal. Both of them are phenomenal performers. I wish the deck had a little bit more channel and height to it. I think it's a very small build area and a very small deck. And you don't, you can't really squonk a whole hell of a lot. You gotta be pretty careful or else you're gonna get, on an exhale, you're gonna get e-juice just spilling out of those air vents. Um, it's leak city uh, nothing leaks around the bottom though. it doesn't come out where the o-rings the ceiling o-rings are comes out of the vent holes the dead rabbit because it's taller you don't get that it's just a great performer so uh, dead rabbit 100% for squonking absolutely is it the first squonk I've played with yeah kind of sorta um, I definitely need to investigate the rest of the squonk world with regards to RDAs. 
or RSAs, whatever the hell you call it, but the rebuildable squonk capable atomizers. Um, I just got to play around with more products and more things. So that's my that's my two cents. I'm gonna let y'all run. My phone's acting all squirrely, and I gotta make some phone calls and get some caffeine. So we'll see. Talk to y'all later.